the information captured to generate the data definition documentation <clears throat> from the source is, sto is stored in a data set named define. It's actually technically underscore define. Now this data set is a data set which contains all the information generated in the define XML, define PDF documentation. That data set is stored in this output library. So depending on your specific study that you selected, you should specify a unique output library so that each study has its own set of um, documentation data set that, is, that keeps track of all of your input data sets. Now to select the output library, you would either select an existing library or um, click on this dot 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 button. This allows you to then uh, create a new library. A library is like a SAS live name, which is a designated name with a specified path. Now, in this case, this path will then contain the information um, capturing all the metadata of the input data set to generate the output data set. So, it's important that you choose the right or a unique output file, uh, live name, output library name, for each one of your studies.